Hello, everybody, and thank you so much for tuning in to Carol's Daily Sauce. So today, what I'm going to be doing for you all really, really quick, and I decided to do this right now at the last minute um, when I was doing my nails. So what we're doing is we're going to be doing a really quick review of a product that I bought on Amazon. Yep, y'all know I am Amazon Queen. It is called the Cosilia um, Artsy Pack. And this one is a smaller one from the last one I had. I'm gonna turn it this way where all the contents is gonna go. So it's Cosilia Nail Arts, uh, Professional Nail Arts C. C for Carol, like I said the last time. So what I want you guys to do is a few things for me. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to click on the bell to be reminded of each and every video that I upload. And um, let's go ahead and get into it. So we've seen already that it comes in a nice little small box. I wanted to do the poly gel um, nails. And the reason I wanted to do them is because they look like they were so easy. So this particular kit was $27.99. It comes with, um, making noise, I'm sorry. It comes with uh, dual forms here. The dual forms were okay. I did um, actually do uh, my manicure, my set, my full set with these. No, I did not like it, but we'll get into that. Like I said, it's the Cosilia Nail Art C kit. And this is just a review of the Poly Gel nail set. Um, I'm horrible when it comes to colors, not because I'm colorblind, but a lot of times when you buy these sets, um, they give you different um, choices. So you can get like a cool set, you can get like a dark set, a deep set. I don't know. Obviously, I must have got a cool one because you get in it. I wrote the colors on here because what they do is they give you six of the poly extension gels they are in you know what as you know i covered up each and every um size i believe it's 15 millimeter poly extension dale get one in clear right here one in clear you get uh, one in pale pink and like i said i put that on there so i would know you get um two pastel pinks so that's a pastel pink this is another pastel pink this is a solid white and then you get another light pink. In addition to that, you get a full size 10 millimeter base coat by Cosilia right here. And then you get a full size 10, uh, top coat uh, 10 millimeter as well from Cosilia. The one thing I can say is about their base coats and their uh, top coats, they are very, very good. Um, in addition to that, this is a kit that allows you to um, get a slip solution in it. So this slip solution is um, how many? In, uh, it's 30 milligrams right here. If you if you ever get a kit that does not have a slip solution, you can always use rubbing alcohol. The wonderful thing that also happened is it comes with a um, a dish for you to use to put your liquid in. But I believe this right here is by far my favorite, favorite, favorite part. Standard, pretty much, a two-in dual brush as well as a spatula, okay? So all of that came in the kit um, for $27.99. It does have, however, the instructions that you read on here um, only tell you the professional usage of common polished gel, meaning um, I guess to put them on top of your natural nails. It doesn't say anything about how to put them on dual, the dual um, tips or anything. So anyway, so how do I feel about the kit? As far as the price, I think the kit was okay. However, these poly extension gels are not, not good to use. A lot of the poly extension gels that you use, you can use them, you use a little bit of liquid, they're soft enough, it goes a long way. These are kind of stiff and you have to do a lot of work. To make a long story short, my first time applying them, it probably took me about two hours. And by the time I was actually finished, they looked nice, but they didn't last long. Followed every step. I am a nail tech, so I know what I'm doing. So what I did on today is I used the poly gel and 
I put the poly gel over tips. So we'll have to, and this is this is the pro, uh, the, this is what they look like before I even put the polish on. I kind of like coffin, rounded coffin, I guess is what they call this um, shape. So I'm going to take another probably 45 minutes to an hour and I'm going to decorate because I have found a holographic powder that I had ordered last year and I also have some silver and gray type of jewels as well as um, um, polish. So I'm not even going to upload this video until I actually finish, but this is what they look like. You know, I will tell you this much. The application with the poly extension gel putting on top of the tips was easy. However, if I had to give this poly gel extension a rating from one to five, I'm not reading and I have on my makeup y'all. I'm just straight up here. Okay. From one to five, um, with five being the highest, I'm sorry, unfortunately, I'd only be able to give this a two because you have to work too, too hard with the um, poly extension gel and you shouldn't have to do that. However, they did give you six of these and two in the same color. So they, they you know, I guess I'm being a little harsh, but if, if it were someone who was... Um, actually a new a person who never really knew how to do nails, who never did nails, who never went to school to do them, this would be very, very frustrating for them. This is not a kit to somebody, for someone who has never done nails. You'll be so frustrated. I mean, literally, it don't take me two hours or an hour and a half to do a full set, but it did because I had to actually work with um, the product. I am going to try um, some of the other products that are a little more pricey. I believe there's one called Model One. I would like to, hopefully they look on here, you know, hopefully they people look on here and, and see the fact um, that I do um, reviews on these. Um, actually, I tell everybody every time I, I, I do a review on Cocilia, Cocilia was one of my first, it was actually my first review, my first product review, and it is also my most watched uh, video. Yes, it is my most watched video. So it's a good, th this right here is a good, I would say it's a good kit for someone who is knowledgeable with working with poly gel. And it's also a good kit for someone who's just knowledgeable in the nail field. If you're not, you're gonna have to go and look for beginner kits because this will do nothing but frustrate you. I had to do minimal filing. Um, it does dry really quick under the um, the UV lamp. It does do that, but compared to my other UV lamps, that I'm not, I'm sorry, not my other UV lamps, but compared to my other gel um, polish that they had, I think I had glass kit had gel in it too, and that didn't work. But this poly gel, I do like it. Listen to it. It's, I mean, it has a good sound. It's hard, so it's a lot better than the last one, but. I don't know. So that's my little review on that. I'll be back in a little bit um, to show you guys my um, manicure. But so far, that's how I feel about that. Thank you. Be right back. Hi. Told you guys I was going to come back because I do want to get the video uploaded. I'm actually finished only with one hand because I've been doing a lot of stuff. But this is what they look like. I have a blinged out one. Then I have one that's just transparent. And I have, it's kind of, kind of oily in a, 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 on my uh, fingers. So that is what they actually look like. Um, I sure, let me see. I can't, let me see, my hand looks huge. But anyway, that's what they look. You guys, I have a crooked uh, uh, finger here. Can y'all see that? No, I didn't put the nail tip on. It's crooked because I used to, you know, most people suck their thumb. When I used to fall asleep, I used to fall asleep with this one and cock my head to the right. So that finger is going to the right, but this is them right here. Um, we got a blinged out one, a transparent one with one jewel, three jewels here and one there. And this is what um, they actually look like. I actually want to get the video up. So uh, I just wanted to come back and show you guys that. Um, 
Thank you so much for tuning in. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to click on that bell. Please share because sharing is most definitely caring. And as I said before, I um, really like Cosilia. Their first product that they sent me was a... Um, actually they didn't send me anything i ordered it from off of amazon and i'm really really funny when i order off of amazon only because you never really know what you're going to get even though they tell you that you can return it you never really know what you're going to get oh my hands are good you never really know what you're going to get and so um yeah but uh anyway you guys um after i do my other hand um and i think it's going to be completely different from this one. I know that's so crazy, but you know, that's how we do them now. So I have three grays um, on this hand, a bling one on this hand, and a transparent. I think what I'm going to do is do the majority of them gray on this hand. I'm going to put some jewels on it, and um, maybe I'll have one transparent too, but it'll probably be on this finger, and I'll probably put some um, jewels on it, but not. I'm not doing this no more. That right there? Mm -mm. That, that actually is a nail that is inspired by um, It's Lovely Mimi. I watched her all day today, and that's one inspired. It does not look like the one It's Lovely Mimi does because she has beautiful ones, and she has a skill. Um, like I said, I did go to school to do nails. However, I have only been doing them for myself um, due to some issues that I had um, with trusting people. So anyway, um, that's it. I hope that you guys like the video. I hope that you share it because sharing is caring, guys. And thank you all for just tuning in. Um, and I really, really need to get my numbers up. You know, guys, I look at everybody else who um, is just growing, growing, growing. And I don't get jealous because I'm very, um, I'm very pleased. But if there are some comments or anything in the section that you can put, like what you want to see, what you think it is that I'm doing wrong, please be kind because I'm always kind to everybody. So I don't want people coming in and being rude. However, I do respect and would love your comments. Thank you so much. You all have a wonderful evening. Talk to you soon.